In this tutorial, we'll show you how to use your Data Video NVS30 to stream on Facebook Live and YouTube Live. To configure the Data Video NVS30, connect it to your internet network using an Ethernet cable. Then enter the IP address the NVS30 displayed at startup into the internet browser of your computer, tablet, or smartphone on the same network. The default login is admin, and the default password is also admin. To stream on Facebook Live, you will need to be an admin of a page for a business or organization that is separate from your personal account. On the dashboard for your page, click on the Publishing Tools and select Videos on the left side of the screen. Next, select Live at the top right of your screen. Now you will see a window with information and links for your stream. Keep this window open from Facebook in your browser. Under the Separate Fields section, copy the server URL and stream key links. Then, go to the window for your NVS30 and paste them into the Stream Settings section. When you're done, click Apply at the top of the screen to save your settings. To start your stream, first push the Stream button on the front of your NVS30 or turn on streaming using your browser. Now, go back to Facebook and click Next on the Create Live Video window. A preview for your stream will load. This will be useful in testing the strength of your connection. On the left side, you can also give your posts a description, video title, and enter in keywords so people can find your stream later. Click Go Live when you're ready to stream. You can monitor your stream from this window, answer comments, and more. You can also close this page in your browser to save bandwidth for your live stream. To end your stream, you can either press the Stream button once again on the Data Video NVS30, or you can manually end it in the Facebook window. When your stream is complete, a public video will be automatically created and uploaded for your fans to view later. To stream on YouTube Live, first log in to the YouTube channel for your live stream. Then, click on your channel icon on the top right and select Creator Studio. On the left side of the window under the Creator Studio section, select Live Streaming. In this window, you can monitor your stream, make a title, description, engage with comments, and more. Next, scroll down the page to the Encoder Setup section. Copy the server URL and stream key links. Then, go to the window for your NVS30 and paste them into the stream settings. When you're done, click Apply at the top of the screen to save your settings. To start your stream, press the Stream button on your NVS30. While you're streaming, you can update the title and description live to better fit the needs of your event. Unlike Facebook Live, when you start streaming on your encoder, the stream will start automatically. To stop your stream, press the Stream button once again. When your stream is complete, a public video will be automatically created and uploaded for your fans to view later. Check out our YouTube channel for more tutorials and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.